you guys it is what is today it's tuesday november 24th yep. and josh and i are in here well actually right now he's cooking dinner he's preparing dinner We're gonna, he's making like a shrimp stir fry stir fry and i'm making my brine for the turkey and i wasn't gonna vlog it because i feel like sometimes i put the camera on josh too much and i don't want to make him feel uncomfortable but can you never make me feel uncomfortable, babe. <laughs> Whatever. But he was like, um. Some people are made for the camera. <laughs> Shut up, you get on my nerves. He was like, um, why are you not vlogging this, babe? I mean, this is our first Thanksgiving, first time we're prepping for Thanksgiving. You should be vlogging this. This is a vloggable moment. And I was like, okay. Facts. <laughs> okay. So, I got my, my brine on the stove right now. And I don't know how many people brine their turkey, but I have been brining their turkey, the turkey, for the last five or six years. And that does make your turkey come out just very juicy. There's no chance of overcooking it or anything like that. I sure can. So, I'm gonna, sh I'm gonna share with you my little ingredients. I actually got this off of Food Network, on, yeah, like five or six years ago, and I kept it in my phone. So for my brine, y'all, I have a cup of kosher salt, half cup of brown sugar, one gallon of chicken stock, tablespoon of black peppercorns, teaspoon and a half of allspice, teaspoon and a half of chopped ginger, and I actually added more than that because I like ginger. Fresh ginger too, ginger root. And yeah, so that's on the stove right now. It's probably gonna be up here for like 30 minutes. And then I have to wait until it cools down before I put it over the turkey. So I might just wait till tomorrow to start brining. Even though Josh says it needs to be brining for 48 hours and that's 24. It's usually, you know, you whatever, said whatever, you whatever said. they say, it's always good to go a little extra. Is it always gonna be a little more tender and a little more get you know, a little more flavor, you know, longer you do stuff, you know? He said 48 hours. And then he was like, remember, I'm on I'm only 75%. So I need to be listening to what Josh says because he yeah, don't like my cooking recipe. all that much. This is your recipe. Well thank you. And everybody loves my turkey. You're making me feel away. I'm, oh, I'm, I'm, I'm like double, uh, what's called double and triple guessing what I'm supposed to be doing. I'm double, triple guessing anything. You don't done this five or six years now, you should know. Everybody else likes it. Well, well I'm sure everybody's gonna like it still. I'm gonna like it too. You better like it or you need to pretend like you like it. Okay. Oh, Josh, what are you cooking tonight? What are you prepping tonight? Prepping prime rib. Prime That's rib. my specialty. I usually do Thanksgiving or Christmas, one or the other. So I'm gonna do a Thanksgiving. I'm doing one for from my family's house. My family's house, and then one for my family's house. He got some big ones too. Let me show you how big they are. I was like, oh, <laughs> going all out. I see. I mean. I mean, they're big. Let's go into the garage refrigerator. Bam, look how big those are. Yeah. Go, babe. Anywho, as you are cooking away, this is coming to a soft bowl, and I'm gonna, I'm gonna let it cool down. And then that's it. Prepare my turkey. Put it in a big pan here. Oops, stuff is on the floor. And then cover the turkey. Josh, are you gonna vlog at your family's house? Babe? So we have to see. You know, my family's not in like how her family is. My family sees cameras, they'd be like, this one way. <laughs> so. At least say hi, everybody. We're seeing. Okay. 
Also, you see, you see all the comments. Everybody liked your vlog, your 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 uh, house tour. They said you look really comfortable, babe. I wasn't, but you know. <laughs> you, know. you look comfortable. You did a good job. Long as it looks he's gonna good. he's gonna vlog more often. Yeah, I, I, gotta get, I gotta get more used to holding the camera and the positioning. Oh, babe, yeah. when we were out hiking, you was all over the place, like, <laughs> Yes. You yeah. had a good time. Yeah. <laughs> I said, so I gotta get better if it's a lot part of the camera, and I'm like, I'm like this talking to the <laughs> camera. So I gotta get a little better with it. All right, so we're gonna finish preparing our food, and we'll check in later. So the stir fry is almost ready. We just wait on the rice. The rice probably got another 10 more minutes, but look at it. I mean, come on, boo. Come it's on. Little, it's a little spicy. A little spicy? You put the um, red pepper flakes in there. Mm -hmm. And I like spicy. It smells good, though. Get a shrimp. Ooh, get great. a shrimp. Get a shrimp? I don't, I, I didn't wash my hands. There, let me get I just washed my Well, that's good. I taste the ginger in there. I like that. Mm, okay. And then I went ahead and I took my brine off heat. So now it needs to, it needs to cool down, which I'm sure it's going to take about 30 minutes, 45 minutes to cool down. We get the bowls out. You want to put it in the bowl or put it in a plate? Um, bowl, please. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Okay. I say this all the time, but you gotta love a man that cooks because, you know, and he don't complain about cooking. He likes to cook. So I like to eat. <laughs> and since I'm a 75, was it 73? He up my percentage to 75 percenter. 75, man. Stop down so little, You gave me that score. So... Yeah, so now he doesn't make me cook anymore. So, bam. Well, not until we start our our diet up because we are whew, slapping heavily. Heavily. But it's really it's it's holidays. It's the holidays. I mean, it ain't the holidays. And it's and it's we also just, hard. Uh, we just fell off the train. It's also hard being on a lifestyle change with this one over here because oh now you're gonna blame me yes oh my. you're a bad influence okay was i was i was i here when you wore the wings last night i was not here i was at work so who who was that Wait, why are you talking about me i'm talking about you right now oh okay but any other time when we when we are on our lifestyle change when we were hitting it heavy we're doing so good josh will go Stray. He went out to dinner with his friends and stuff, and I'm like, really? You can't. You can't be doing this. <laughs> Things come up. We man. have no, babe. Things Guys, come... night. You go. You go out. Watch See, football. Have wings. You know. You but no. Uh, I want you to be as committed as me. And when he's not as committed as I am, it makes me want to stray as well. Like I feel like he's cheating. I need to be cheating too. You know. Y'all feel me? Nope. I know I should be. <laughs> I know I should be strong for myself, but I gotta have somebody to lean on, you know? But that's all right. Mom's gonna do it with me. She said if I if I meal prep her stuff, we gonna hit it together. Cause you know, she's on her road to 60. She's trying to get healthy and stuff like that. I mean, I'm on my road to 34. I'm trying to get healthy too, you know? You youngin. All right, let me cut my music back on because I was in here jamming. Jamming! You mean jamming? Hey, hey, <laughs> hey, hey, witness to this. Who's, who's, whose candies are these right here? <laughs> Who picked these up? Did I get any candy when we were at the grocery store? Nope. This is, she did. Does anybody else eat Andy's? These are the best chocolates ever. Ever. <sighs> you used to have these at Piccadilly. Mm -hmm. Don't try to change the subject. I saw them and I had to pick it up. It's nostalgia. Memories from my childhood. Oh, trust me, I passed a lot of stuff. I passed like some airheads, some gummy worms. 
You don't need to buy anything else. You have this entire yeah, thing yeah, right like, here. Yeah, but you, you get tired of the same thing, you know? LA's get old after like. Oh, you get tired of the same thing all the time? What you trying to say? You get tired of the same thing all the time? Really? Why are you going to switch it up? No, what you mean? <laughs> what you mean right now? Huh? Why are you going to switch it up? Uh uh. It's, it's still good. No, 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 no. It's still good. <laughs> but, you know. but what? But what? But what? Yeah, it's don't so get hurt in here. You the can choose got, your words wise. It's not hard. So like it's really hard to chew sometimes. So you know that softer candy sometimes. You know. So you need a different candy a little here and there. Choose your words. <laughs> uh huh. Yeah. Next subject. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So I got my turkey in a brine. So everything that was in the pot, I poured into this pot, and then I added about two and a half gallons of water, uh, to cold water, to this pot. So now I'm going to put it in the refrigerator and let it marinate for two days. Two for two days. And then Josh is over here preparing his rib roast. Bam. So you just put in the just putting the garlic in there. Put the garlic in and I'll rub on the outside and then before I cook it, I'll put my seasoning in I already made up with my butter, spread it all over, pop it in the oven. How long is it supposed to cook for? I gotta look at it, it's all goes by the poundage. So I gotta look at the poundage and then go by the time. Mm-hmm. More to come. More to come. And this is what he made for them. This is just one, he made two for each. I mean, one for each. But this is what, rosemary, did you put the thyme in there? Rosemary, thyme. Um, garlic. Garlic, salt, pepper. Yeah, that's pretty much it, yeah. When do you add the butter to it, right before you put it on the? Yeah, you gotta soften the butter up and then you mix that with the butter, soften it up and then you smear it all over it. And you, and you don't do that to marinate, you just do it right before you cook. Yeah. Will I write you that? Chef Josh teaching me something. As always. 